Hi, Mark Atchison here for Split Lath Threadman Aprilia. I'm about to do a lap on the Nissan GTR of Brands Hatch. So approach, this is our lap of Brands Hatch into turn one. I hope it all makes sense. <laughs> we want to look at quite a mid-track sort of entry here. Follow the white line just to the left of the white line. And there's a big under, big big dropout point through through turn one here, which is really fun on the motorcycle. So exit out of turn one, we're in third gear here. As we drop down, there's a big bottom out point on the exit of turn one. You're still hard on the throttle as you're coming up under the, uh, let's call it the monster bridge, monster energy bridge, to turn two into Druids. This is a really tricky part to get right actually because you're back to second gear. You want to apex a little bit early and almost make two points of it. So we're a little bit wide on the, the mid part of turn two. And then as you can see, dropping down out of turn two, you're really on the throttle nice and early, really hard on the gas. Again, all in second gear. As we exit out of Druids and down into turn three. Trying to just link up turn three. Nice and simple. All you want to do is make sure you've got some good rolling speed through there. And as you exit out of here, up second to third and then back to second, and I can't see where I'm going because <laughs> we've got, we got, we got a bit of a, a bit of fog going on here. And back into turns, turn four, back to second, driving out of here really hard. This is gonna set you up for your, the big run onto the straight. It's very important to, to get a good exit out of here so you can short shift gears all the way down through the back straight here. Really important to to link up from, from turn four, they link up all the way through onto the straight section and just let the bike settle itself all the way down the back straight here. You'll find the, the super bike always wheelies and tries to pitch itself all the way down this hill. Into Hawthorne Bend, I was six to three. Uh, so we're going using six gear in the back straight on the Aprilia. And uh, back to third into Hawthorne, which is it's quite, a, quite a fast corner actually. You know, it's really, really fast in the middle and you can really use good exit speed to get out of and driving really hard in third gear along the back here, running along the white line. And pitch in here, still in third gear. Not using all the circuit on exit. Now we're coming down to almost into sheen curve and this is another big bottom out point where you click fourth, driving up into sheen curve and all this is blind, this is all really blind. So in the apex you, can't, you physically can't see anything from this point. And it opens up right about now. Back to third. Hold third all the way through here and just let it try and keep a nice consistent run through here. You just want to hold throttle, which is really important. Back to second. And this is Sterling Bend, which is really difficult, really easy to get wrong. Really difficult to get right on my bike at the moment. Second, third, fourth down into, uh, into the final corner, into clearways which is a really fun part of the circuit. Once you link it up and get all the apexes right, Brands Hatch is an amazing circuit to ride. Everything feels really close. All the walls, all the, uh, the barriers feel super close. For me, personally, coming from European circuits at the beginning of the season, driving onto the front straight, clicking third, fourth, fifth, and coming across the start-finish line. And that's your lap of Brands Hatch.